welcome to my channel my name is bro and today we're gonna be unboxing another new brand on my channel it is gonna be called Manu Atelier I could be pronouncing that wrong I'm not sure how to pronounce it but I'll leave it on the screen for you guys this is my first bag from them and I'm very excited like I said I've been super into contemporary brands lately so I'm glad to be introduced to some um, really nice contemporary brands so if you guys have any please let me know I would love to check them out as well I did get this item on um, 24S. They have a sale going on right now. That's an extra 20% off their sale items. So I was just kind of browsing through their sale and I came across this bag and I was doing some research about them and they are a brand from Turkey and they are huge on sustainability and all their items um, are made like their handcrafted leather good items. So I was very excited to hear that they were really big on sustainability and that all their items are handcrafted. So I really wanted to check them out and so I picked up this one. This is the um, Manu Antier. I still can't pronounce it. I'll leave it on the screen once again. <laughs> um, this is their cylinder bag. It's super cute. It didn't come with a box. It just came in this bag and then a dust bag. This is very cute. I love this dust bag. I got this bag in a color that I normally don't go for. I got it in a light color. Um, normally I really like dark tone bags because I think that it goes with my outfits a little bit more, but for some reason I really like this bag in this. Um, I think of it as like a soy milk kind of color, but on the website it is um, called a light yellow. And it is pretty, it's like a, it has like a hint of yellow, but it reminds me of soy milk. So I really like the color, but this bag actually is bigger than what I thought it would be. I actually thought that it would be um, a little bit smaller, like maybe like two thirds of its size. So I'm excited to see what this looks like on my body because I really thought this was gonna be a small bag, but it's actually pretty big for a cylinder bag. So see what it looks like on. Here's what the bag looks like on. It is really cute. I actually think that it looks cuter in this size than what I thought it would have been um, if it was smaller so it would be missing like that much. But I think being bigger, it's very unique. And I thought that this chain was gonna be a little longer. So from the pictures that I was seeing online, I thought that this chain was gonna be at least like a crossbody length. But I don't think that this could be a crossbody. Like it would be like a really high crossbody yeah it's like a really high crossbody and I don't know if I like this look at all um it's a little too high for my liking because of how like it's kind of bulging out so I don't know I don't really think that this would be a crossbody bag for me I think this would mainly be a shoulder bag which as a shoulder bag it looks really cute like I really like how this looks and it's comfortable but Sadly, this will not be a um, crossbody for me, but I still really think that it's super cute and this logo is adorable. So let's take a look on the inside and give you guys a little closer look at this chain. Okay, let's take a look at this bag here. It is super adorable. I love all the detailing of the bag. Like the stitching is super nice. This is handcrafted. It is gorgeous and then I love the detailing here this gold is super nice um, it's like a light gold and then it, it's one of those um, rings what are these called I can't think of what these are called <laughs> but it's one of these rings and then here is the chain the chain is actually very unique so um, here is what it looks like on its front and then on the side it looks like this so it's super unique the little clasps on the end um i thought that these clasps are a little small for what this ring is like it's a little i mean it's like a perfect size but i thought it was a little small it's a little hard to take off so it's a little hard to take off because of how small the hole is but that's okay it's not a problem and then let's take a look on the inside there's some stuffing it is um lined with suede let's take all the stuffing out a lot of stuff in here okay so this is what the bag looks like here is some cards let's take a look at what this card is um here is what this bag is called and then here's a little note from the brand this is super cute okay and then here is what the bag looks like on the inside it is a suede lining um and then there is a inner pocket with a zipper 
here's what the inner pocket looks like. This inner pocket is really nice. I really like that they added that. It's not just one big cylinder. That's what the bag looks like. Overall, I do think that this bag is super beautiful and unique. I love this color so much. I'm so excited that I got to add this color to my collection without breaking the bank. I believe the retail on this range from like five something to 700, I believe. I, I could be wrong. I'm gonna leave the correct number on the screen for you guys, but this bag does go on sale. So currently I do see that this bag is on sale on some websites. So I will leave the links down below for you guys so you guys can take advantage of the sale as well. I got this one on 24S for about a hundred and something dollars. So I do think that this is definitely worth that. Um, the quality of it is amazing. It's handcrafted. Um, the leather is great and it's super unique. The chain is super nice. Like I love this chain so much and the details on this is amazing. So I definitely think that this bag is definitely worth it and you guys can definitely check it out. I will leave all the links down below. And that was it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give this video a like. And also if you guys haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button down below. It means the absolute world to me. And I love talking to you guys. So please leave me comments as well. And I hope to talk to you guys soon. Please let me know what you guys think of the bag. I'm on this contemporary brand journey right now. And I love contemporary brands. So please, if you guys have any contemporary brands that you guys love, please leave me comments down below and I would love to check them out. And I hope to talk to you guys soon.